Andrea at Salt Lake City, join this hot conversation about air travel. Yeah, it's uh, it's probably the most enlightening conversation I've had all day. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm actually more with uh, Kevin Downey Jr. on the whole uh, just avoiding blood clots in my legs. That's kind of at the top of my to-do list. <laughs> yeah. My feet always hurt anyway, so... Yeah. Why does it? Why do the? Why do tight socks? It almost seems counterintuitive. The idea that a tight sock would help control things like uh, veins right. and other things like that. Uh, well, because it's simulating muscle contractions, which is how uh, circulation through our veins uh, actually works. Oh, well, so, a, actually, a perfect I mean, answer be, to that question. Be perfect. It was more intermittent <laughs> squeezing rather than continual, but yeah. Yeah. I'm uh, impressed you knew made, that because I, I, I had no nurse. idea. That's great. Yeah, yeah. Where'd it go, no, well, Andrea? Andrea's she's she's been around. She's she a friend of the show. A lot yeah. about uh, uh, yeah. I'm many subject things. matter expert, really Jane of all trades. So. I'm going to do a quick <laughs> a hard turn in the story department, and I'll leave you uh, with us. Uh, maybe if you have an opinion on this, I don't know if you saw Lindsey Vaughn win her uh, event last night. She got a a bronze medal, but to, to her it felt like a gold. She commented in the press that she feels she's been unfairly attacked because. She aligned herself with the kind of anti-Trump crowd. This is Lindsey Vaughn earlier. Well, I hope to represent the people of the United States, not the president. Uh she said that. She also said she wasn't going to visit the White House. And so some of the, the Trump supporters used to attack her online. They were hoping for her to fail and things like that. And uh, do you feel bad for Lindsey Vaughn? Kevin? No. <laughs> she made a political. What does she do? Skate or ski? I don't know what she does. Skier. She's, She's a great a skier. skier. Go, I mean, go ski and, and win, but don't make it political. Come on. And she dated, um, what's his face? Tiger. She dated Tiger Woods. Oh. Tiger Woods, yeah. right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I heard I heard her bronze identifies as a gold. <laughs> <laughs> she brought home, I, I'm glad we got another American medal. But Andrea, the thing is, athletes are allowed to speak out. We spoke about this a little yesterday. But do you think they should take the heat with it? Because I'm reading Melania Trump, saddened by the loss of televangelist, I'm, I'm sorry, of saddened by the loss of evangelist Billy Graham, uh, his t t spiritual teachings, etc. He will be deeply missed. That was her tweet this morning. People attack her. Oh, yeah, you mean you? You take off your clothes for money? Oh, you floozy. You know, I mean, just one attack after another. When she's mourning the loss of a spiritual man, people get attacked online. I feel like the people, I feel like people on the right don't complain about it. They just get attacked. Am I wrong about that, Andrea? Uh, I definitely think that the right is more open for attack. However, I think Lindsey Vaughn got attacked pretty hard, too, because, hey, she went political. But at the same time, she's an athlete. It's not like we're expecting brilliant, deeply heartfelt sentiments coming out of her <laughs> mouth anyway. Yeah. We expect her to come back from that torn ACL and broken arm and uh, compete in the Olympics, which she, you know, managed to. But, yeah, yeah Melania expressing uh, deep sympathies, uh, being attacked for something that she did decades ago is pretty unreal.